Hello, hello, hello. Oh, hold on. <laughs> it's a little loud. There we go. Alrighty, so yeah, we're back with some more Subnautica. Honestly, I just wanted an excuse to go somewhere cooler in Subnautica. It definitely has the envi environment for it. Whether it was the first or second one, either way, we're in the water and that's all I need right now. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's switch over to the game then, shall we? One second to mute this audio. There we go. Now, here's the fun game of remembering what I was doing last time, because I don't remember. We got, let's see. I know we had some new blueprints to work on. Water purification tablets, Pathfinder tool, not that important. Um, oh yeah, Provence bed. We built that, didn't we? I'm pretty sure we replaced our uh, our usual bed with Provence bed. Yeah, that looks sick. Plus, we got all these neat posters. I love the artwork ones, but I feel like this one, that's a lot more realistic, would probably freak me out at night. Oh, wait. Uh, audio check. Make sure everything's good. Yep, we're good. I do think our head guest did tell us there was something else to explore. I can't remember what it was. I probably should have gone back and watched the other stream just to be sure on what I was doing today, but eh, say la vie. Dun, 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 dun. Was there something I need to build here? I don't think so. Well, maybe a large glass room, but like that's kind of frivolous. I don't, I don't really need one. I just want one. We might be going after some kyanite if I can figure out where to go deep enough for it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Because we need it to upgrade the depth module on Titan. Plus, we need a few other things for Titan. Um, eh, hold on. We need to get the other arm upgrades for Titan, like the grappling arm and the propulsion cannon. Though, admittedly, the, propul the propulsion cannon isn't that important to me. Uh, we're also going to build some dock modules for Voyager, or Voyage, because I want to start exploring how that will help. Things like sea truck teleportation module will be really helpful. Or, um, the sea truck docking module could be really helpful, if it is what I think it is. So let's try building that next. Plasteel ingot, lead, and advanced wiring kit. Alright, we can do that. And... Let's do a storage module too, since we're going to be mining some resources, for, uh, at least for this stream. Beacon management. We have three new beacons now. Uh, five robotics landing pads, signal last known position, and architect PK-8. I'm pretty sure we went after PK-8 already, so I'm not sure why it's marking it as new. Yeah, that's definitely been seen. Anywho. Let's get to work on these plasteel ingots. We need... We're gonna need a lot of titanium. Luckily, we have some. Not a lot, but we have some to start working with. And I think we're gonna box up the spy penguin for a bit, just because I have no idea what to do with it. 
then you have to be in range for it, for it to do anything, so not really much point in leaving it anywhere. Uh, Ion Cube. Unless we need to take it with us? I can't think of a reason to do that. Okay, cotton enemy can go in the biological matter box. Same with the spiral clamp, plant clipping. Uh, we already did the thing with... Hi oh yeah, we need to explore a little further in the ice region, but I said I was going to take titan over there rather than the snow fox because the snow fox was getting pretty beat up that and i think there were areas and i needed the drill for biological matter goes in here so that we could fit more nutrient blocks and personal equipment in here we have so many eggs i need to deal with i need a containment unit like asap <laughs> All right. So let's get started here. We need two silver. We're going to need to collect more silver, by the way. Actually, no, we're totally fine. And we also have an advanced wiring kit already, so we can build these almost immediately. Some titanium. I think it was five. One, two, three, four, five. For two plasteel ingots. What else do we need for plasteel? Lithium. Is it two lithium for one plasteel? Yes, it is. Uh, we might need to get some lithium. Because I only have one extra on hand. Alright, let's go down for that before we start on any... Right. Well, not down. I know exactly where to get lithium. Uh, let's just throw it in here with the other one. But never mind, there's no room. In here. Titan! We have a quest! The prawn suit in this game feels so much more controlled than the first one. Like, just adding adding that forward jetpack makes the maneuverability go up by so much. Oh shoot, uh, I didn't notice, but uh, I guess we have a new follower on the crew now. Thanks for the follow, Danger Minty. Alright. I know there's lithium around here because this is where it usually gets generated. We got plenty of salt. There we go. Lithium. I only need one piece, but I might as well stock up a bit, because we're completely out back home. Where's my... There you are. Did I seriously have you in the first spot? I have this arranged so weirdly. Okay, you should definitely be first, since we don't have the Seamoth with us. And why not put the flashlight there? Uh oh. Okay, it's not close enough to be completely worried. Grab a quick breath. And we start searching. There we are.
Sometimes this thing is annoying because it keeps blipping things that are like underground. Mm, don't like that. Ah, oh, that freaked me out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> when you hear a roar and then you hear something pop up behind you. <laughs> yeah. It's a little jarring. I hate this area in general. Uh, don't get me wrong, I love the thermal vents and I'm glad that there's lithium here. But there's so many things that can kill you here. Not just those guys. There's a bigger one around the area that that can actually grab hold of the ship or any vessel that you happen to be in Careful. any lithium around here Nope. Usually it'll blip immediately and we don't have to worry. I should have just turned on the scanner room. We have more than enough uh, biofuel for it. I think we're gonna have to settle for two because it's gonna take a while to keep searching. I'm still curious as to whether or not these are geothermal because they kind of look like they're biological. Hang on, that was good. Well, I can't. No, those are geothermal. Yeah, for now we're gonna have to settle for two just because I don't have I don't think I'll be able to find it on my own at least not fast enough that and we only need the two also I'm going the wrong way and punching my microphone We can make it, we can make it, we can make it, yeah, we can make it. Welcome Is there anything in your storage module? Yes, there is, let's unload. Too many samples of that. Into the biological matter lo locker you go. Um, what did I even need flowering spores for? I can't remember. This one, we needed two silver and ten titanium. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One more. And hit me with that plasteel. Hit me again. Okay, now I just need an advanced wiring kit. 
Cool. Oh shoot, lead. I think we're out of lead, actually. Alright, we're going on an adventure for lead. Let's put the components we already have in here, just so we're not worrying about where to find them later. And we need to drink... I think we have extra, like, tiny water in here, so I don't have to waste all of it. Was it 50? Okay, we can wait to drink that. Uh, we're gonna eat one of our nutrition blocks for now. Just because I don't feel like hunting. Oh, Titan, we're going uh, lead hunting. I almost got it. There is a way that you could just jump into it. You just gotta aim it properly. Further! Whoops! Sorry about that! Am I going too far down for lead? I'm not entirely sure. Okay, there was that thing growling, but then there was something even louder than it growling. You want to come at me, go ahead. Now's the time for you to turn away, because I'm about to get out of my vehicle. Uh... Can you run away, please? Alright, sir. You need to leave. There we go. Okay, because I need to get out for repairs and to scan that thing. One hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh shoot! Yeah, I don't have my rebreather on me. Not you. Okay, we already had that, but luckily I have more titanium for it. Okay, we're looking for any type of mineral outcropping. I know there's a giant worm thing down here, too. I'm not too concerned about it, as long as I'm with Titan. I think we have more than enough diamond back on base. on storage modules. I could have sworn when I was getting into Titan I saw a tail swim up behind us.
Fabricator again. I just want to see if I can get those last two modules. I'm only missing one part off of both of them. I'm guessing that's probably another Fabricator one. Yep. It was awful being eaten down here last time I came down. I can't imagine what it would be like to get eaten down here and know that I left Titan down here. Pretty sure we're safe at Yeah, there's like the in-between depth. Nothing really comes over here. There we go. So Galenia. There you are. There we go. Another lead. We need six of ya. I'm pretty sure we're good on silver, so I don't need to find the Argentine outcrops. Oh, oxygen. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. We're good, we're good. I know we don't have a rebreather, but we're good. We can drink this now. Okay, if there's nothing else, Warning. like, Boxing in this area, meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. we should probably bring Titan up, too. Just so I have somewhere to duck into if I need it. Just one more will do it. Though I wouldn't be opposed to getting a lot more.
There it is. Hold on. Bring Titan over. We're going to plop you right next to the O2 plant. Yeah, normally I'd stop at 6, but I kind of want to stock up before we head back. Man, I wish there was a way to indicate depth of what you were looking for. Oh shoot, oh shoot, I lost chat, hold on. Hang on, almost there. Okay. I'm getting better at identifying it by sight. But this thing also kind of keeps misdirecting me because it detects Galenia like way away from what I'm looking looking at. Enough for one extra module if we need it. I hope later on we find a place that we can just drill lead. I didn't realize how far from base we had moved because we dropped directly from it. And up. I was thinking, uh, just because I don't really have much else going on after work today that if I have some time in the afternoon, I might do another random game stream. Mostly consisting of Risk of Rain, because I recently reinstalled it into the computer and I kind of wanted to check it out again since there have been a few updates. That and there's a lot to unlock in Risk of Rain. Okay, all our components are ready. I think we have to go to the mobile vehicle bay for them. Um, let's throw most of this in here, because we don't need the titanium right now. And we don't need three. <sighs> we don't need three of these lead right now. There we go. 
Oh, why do I have... I have Christmas songs stuck in my head. I don't know why. As long as there's Christmas. I, I don't need that right now. Why? Why is it stuck in my head? Alright, voyage. Let's go. Well, we're off to a good start. I'm just clipping the top of my base. Ooh, it looks spooky up here. Let's go. No! Redeploy! I assume this is how you, yep, this is how you do it. Okay. I want a sea truck docking module and a sea truck storage module. Did I call that a ducking module? What's going on with my mouth today? Cool, let's not crash that one into the one I have right now. Luckily that it didn't that didn't sink. I legit don't know how this works. Is it how how does one do you back up into it or maybe I should have done some research. <laughs> I legitimately don't know how this works. Um, I assume you just back up into it, maybe? Okay, hold on. I'm just gonna line myself up. Alright, turn around. Okay, that is how that works. Gotcha. Oh, cool! Oh, that's cool. Okay, uh, let's drive this over. <laughs> Just down here a bit. I want to see if I can pick up Titan. I love it already. Titan! We may have work to do. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Maybe we detach this module. Yeah, we'll build a storage module. And, um... We'll attach that first, then the docking one. Then we attach Titan, and I think we're good to go. Weather approaching. Take shelter. We're good. How does one undock a module? Ah, there you go. That freaked me out for a sec. Just, it was just gone. Okay. Oh, cool, and it recolors for, uh... It recolors for Voyage. That's really cool. Alright, well, same thing. Line ourselves up. Back up. Crash into it. <laughs> okay, wait. Uh... Mm-hmm, 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 south. We're on the wrong side, then. There we go. <laughs> I damaged my own module. Don't worry, we'll, we'll repair it. Okay, uh, so this is the door side. Let's see what we can do. Crash into it, got it. Okay. 
line up, turn around, back up. Okay, aim more up, I think. I'm not sure. There we go. Okay, we have lockers here. That's cool. That's cool. A little foot locker. How much? No, get back. No, we're not lame. Oh, okay, now there's locker E. Cool. I just want to see how much storage per locker we got. Quite a bit. Honestly, I thought it'd be like a a 5x5 five five or something like that. Alright, th this is going to be interesting to drive. I already had issues driving the sea truck on its own. I don't know how this is going to go. But it's going to be fun either way. Uh, let's line up sea truck to pick up Titan. Alright, Voyage, let's do this. I have to be careful because we now we got a big old honk and caboose to worry about. Oh, that looks cool. Titan! Let's go! Arise, or rather, descend! Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's so cool! Okay, uh, let's see what upgrades we can make for now. Because if we can get like, um, what's it called, what's it called, what's it called? A solar power upgrade for the sea truck, that would be perfect. Because then we never have to worry about power for the Titan on the way over. Perimeter defense, Citra. Oh, we don't have that as a thing. Where are all our upgrade areas? Uh, prawn suit, thermal upgrade. Yeah, that's something we need to find, unfortunately. Either way, we got what we wanted. Alright. Let's take you over to the Phi Robotics landing pad. I assume that's how pr that's pronounced, but I could be wrong. Okay, if anything attacks us, hit w hit one. I have to keep that in mind. Ah, oh, shoot. Yeah, we're gonna need water, and I guess I'll pick up some. F Actually, no, let's just pick up some food here. That's what I usually have an inventory slot one. There we go. That makes more sense. I did get one suggestion of building a grav trap outside of my house. And that's probably a really good idea so I'm not constantly having to chase the peepers. I could just slash and go. so cool. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Go 
we explored that? Yeah, I got the outdoor grow beds from that. I want to be sure. Don't want to leave behind any information that we might need. Ba -ba. Whoops. Oh yeah, I'm going to be putting up a poll on Twitter. Uh, because it seems like there's genuinely a lack of interest in the Days Gone series. And it kind of, um... Oh wait, yeah, we need to go a little bit closer. Like, honestly, I'm not sure if I want to continue with it. I've been talking with Zion about, uh how the game goes and she was saying that it gets a little political later on and I'm worried about that because I'd rather not introduce that <laughs> at least not here Hollow chamber in iceberg interior detected what no hollow chamber Okay, we need to find that. Also, I need to watch this caboose. I keep swinging around all willy-nilly. Oh, shoot. Is there a reorientation button? Because we are sideways. My goodness. This might fix it. Hold on. <laughs> no, it did not. Oh, no. Oh, what's happening? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. I think we're stuck. That's what happened. I wasn't paying attention. Titan, help. Perfect. Good job, Titan. Ooh, okay, that could have been really bad. <laughs> Gotta be careful with the jellies. Don't want to crash into any of them. Not because they'll harm the vehicle. I think the vehicle might be fine. I just really don't want to hurt them. Pretty sure here is good. We can just grab tight and get out of here. Oxygen efficiency decreased. I just gotta remember where I parked. Mm. 
little baby jellies. Look at them. They're so cute. If y'all don't hear my birds this stream, it's because I have the sound curtain kind of closed. So uh, they're a little bit muffled. Whoops. Luckily that giant worm thing hasn't been introduced as a water-based creature. And that already just jinxed it and is going to come down here and kill me. Who knows? Oh, if we were coming back here, I should have probably brought decoy pangling. Oh well. Where is that growling coming from? That's where I'm heading. I parked really far away. I was just curious as to what the iceberg tunnel would look like. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Am I gonna be able to get back up here? I don't know. I might have to go around to get Voyage again. To be really really like super careful with this one I can't see two uh, I don't know if the worm can damage my my suit a huge amount I'm hoping they can praying they can Here we go. 
If on the first hit he does a lot of damage, we're retreating immediately. I am not losing Titan to this. Limited visibility is definitely going to be an issue. Did we not collect whatever this is? How did we not? We for we sure got the that. thumper last time. I'm hoping this isn't like the snow fox where it's gonna throw me out of the vehicle every, th every time that thing gets near us. Okay, here we go. I can't even hit it. Here we go. I'm not even sure this is going to be worth it. We came here for energy <laughs> cubes. Which I'm sure will come in handy eventually, but... Uh... Just this, this fog is messing with navigation so much, I can't see anything, so it's kind of hard to orient myself. How do these things not set off the worm?
I think I may be able to break my way up there. So far, I'm having better luck with Titan when it comes to maneuvering out of the way. You can't damage it at all. Okay, good to know. And he does a fair amount of da Okay. He does a fair amount of damage. Oh my gosh, no! And one more. There we go. I better not be up here risking my life for basic minerals. Okay, cool. It needs energy though. We don't have an energy cell on us. <sighs> Shoot. Okay. I don't know if there's a way to get Titan in here. Not because he'll help with the energy cell problem, it's because, uh, I don't want to go through this teleporter without Titan or some type of armor on me. Altera found this place. Who am I kidding? Of course Altera found this place. Love it. Hate it, but love it. <laughs> Nutrient block! Yes! I, I was kind of concerned about our hunger. It was, uh... I'm getting a little low. You can just get over here... Huh. So you don't have to go through the danger warm area to get here. Okay, now the bigger question, where was that huge stash of ion cubes? I know it was somewhere here, and that's exactly what I need to get this teleporter up and running. I mean, realistically speaking, I... I oh! Hey there, Drewcast! How's it going? Sorry, I wasn't looking over at chat. Uh, I was a little preoccupied with the alien tech I was finding. Also, hello, Tinny. Welcome to the stream. 
And no worries, man. I'm just glad to have you here. Okay, it was this way. Oh, I'm out in the open. Tighten any chance you can squeeze through this. Yes, okay, good. Well, thank you, thank you. My tailor did a pretty good job on it. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, it dives! Oh, my goodness, it dives! I didn't know it could do that! Why do you do that? <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Alright, in here for repairs. Yeah, definitely. It's it's chunking a quarter of my health every time it comes out of the ground. Howdy. Alright, seriously, how is anything else aside from the worm living here? There's no way that anything could survive it. It eats stalkers. Why are there stalkers living here? Okay, we gotta hop down, figure out where this energy cube area is, because I, I remember seeing it last stream. I just don't remember where it is or how to get it. Well, here we go. And there goes half my health. Oh, thanks for the follow, Drewcast. Ah, uh, yeah, I didn't think it ate stalkers either. Like I thought maybe that wasn't programmed as an interaction, but nope, it, it, it straight up eats stalkers. And I'm hoping it eats more stalkers than it does damage my uh, prawn suit. I really don't want to lose Titan to this. More the diving thing? Is, is that what you're referring to? Oh, shoot. Uh, here we go. Or maybe the swipe. <laughs> I didn't know it could do that either. I think it's just mad that I'm its, in its territory. Which, understandable. But also, leave me alone. Oh, it actually hit me last time. Shoot. Okay, we need to get somewhere we, where we can repair and not be killed. Wait, is that it? Is that the cave I've been looking for? The cave of wonder? Oh, uh, shoot. Get in the cave. Get in the cave. Yes, this is it. This is it. Okay. Now we have fuel for the teleport. Ow my ankles every time I get out of the prawn suit. Time to drill. Okay, so this will fuel up the teleporter. I have no idea where it could possibly take us. So this is gonna be... this is gonna be fun. <laughs>
Luckily, I can at least take the prawn suit through the teleporter. I was... I'd be terrified if I had to go through it on my own. Thank you. Let's grab everything we can, because why not? Yeah, if the worm could just go on with its day and just kill stalkers and not me, that'd be lovely. I seriously don't know why anything else would ever try to live here. Like, I'd clear... As any type of species, I'd clear out of the area immediately. As soon as Stabby Worm showed up. Last one... I actually don't know if I have room for the last one, but might as well. They regenerate anyways. Oh wait, no, these don't. It's that it, it's like a very specific one that regenerates ion cubes. Just a little bit more. Cool, it all fit. We only needed one, but we got like, what, 20 now? I can't check right now. And I, I don't want to get out of the prawn suit if I don't have to. Okay. Beeline for the cave, let's go. Good, we're good, we're clear, nothing's coming. Look. Just get up on that cliff. I can hear the ground rumbling. Here we go. Shoot, wait, wait, wait. It's that lower cave I need to get into. Not here. I cannot see a thing outside. Uh. Alright. I was about to taunt him, but I feel like he's gonna come in and stab me if I try. Let's just go and get to the top. Oh yeah, I remember. Okay. We're good, we're good. He's got a sneaky in here. One eye on Q, por favor. Uh, can we grab some snow from here? Yeah, good. because we're running low on water. Food will be okay. All right, let's go. Into the breach. I I should probably be concerned that this could take me to a a horrible crush depth, but No, we're good. We're good. Where are we? Oh, I think we've been here. Yeah, we've been here. This is just the other side of the iceberg. Alright, I had nothing to be worried about. We've been here before. Ow. We've been here before.
All right. Cool. Honestly, I thought that was going to be more exciting than it ended up being. Oh, I suppose we can get this out of the way. Can we? There we go. I don't think I need flares for anything, really. Batteries. Yeah, good amount of loot, but not loot that I wanted. All right, let's go, Titan. Shoot, now this entire trip feels frivolous. <laughs> we didn't get anything out of it. I mean, we got like a ton of ion cubes. So that's good. But now we have to get all the way back without dying. And we have to figure out where we park the sea, the sea truck. Careful, careful, careful. My goodness, that thing can jump high. Okay. We did get some info, but... Uh, most of it was stuff I kind of knew about already. Straight for the exit. Even if it attacks, we should be fine. Because we're fully healed and everything, so... I'm not worried. Here it comes. Right, right, that is... I don't know if it's a valuable piece of information. It's a terrifying piece of information. But it is information. Alright. Let's go. I hope there's nothing else on land that's bigger than a worm. Because, yipe. I know there's definitely bigger things in the sea than that worm. We found one of them frozen. Actually, no, that thing had... That thing had legs. It probably could have come on land whenever it wanted. Now to figure out where we parked Voyage. Which shouldn't be too hard. Yeah. 
Yeah. The sound the sound design in this game in general is fantastic. Like hats off to whoever worked on it. Same thing in the first game. That's one of the, one of my favorite things is to mess around with sound. And uh, being able to create a good monster or that's an art. Because you don't want something that will just alert the person. You want something that will shake their bones. Yeah, kind of. I think it'd be classified as, as a Leviathan class entity. They're all just crowding around my car. Alright, let's go. Careful I don't touch that thing on the way in. We still got a lot of energy on the sea truck, and since it's charging Titan, we might. Well, we should pick up some supplies back home before. Actually, yeah, let, let's pick up some supplies back home and also drop off all the ion cubes that we have, because we have a full thing of them. Wait a minute, no, we have storage modules in here. Oh, I crashed into something. We have storage modules in the sea truck now, so I don't have to worry about that. Don't know why I have that. Uh, drop this off. And these ones. Oh, and all the batteries. Except one. We should probably switch one of these out. There you go. Flares, because I really don't think I need them. So yeah, we still got time to explore. We got plenty of power. I, I don't think it's gonna drain too much charging Titan. Whoops. I want to find a deeper area. Uh, somewhere I can get near 700 feet at least. Because I'm still on the lookout for Kainite, and I don't know where I would find it. I keep seeing the top of the jellyfish heads like, oh, that looks promising. And, oh, wait, no, no, no. We've seen a few hundred of those now. The open waters are both terrifying and tranquil. Because, like, there's nothing here. But, at any minute, something can be here. Something massive that can fit in this wide open area and will probably kill me in one hit. Um, have we hit the edge? Is this the eco dead zone? Kind of looks like it. I hate that. <laughs> Stare off into the void. We could always try and take Titan down and see what's if there's anything worth exploring. <laughs> Uh, 
All right, Titan. Putting you in danger again. Actually, uh, let's lower the sea truck a bit so it's not hard to dock him if we need to run. There we go. Okay, maybe I don't want to take Titan down? I'm not seeing any ledges I can grab onto, and I don't have a grapple hook for this. Yeah, maybe not the best idea. Because the jump jet's great, but I don't think it's escape the, the depths of hell great. <laughs> I'm surprised there isn't much here. I was thinking like we'd find a lot more biomes clustered together. Okay, this this looks familiar. Um, yeah, this is the, the huge mushroom tree. I think there was something here that I was supposed to find. Either way, this is a place I wanted to explore. So let's just park Event the seat. Garden. Harvests geothermal energy to nurture the life that grows within. Really? All right, cool. Maximum depth range. Yep, backing up. Uh, we need to find a place to park, just so I can dock again if I need to. That looks all right. The nearby spires are substantial thermal vent structures. Hospitable to coral formation. Cool. I think this will do. walking on the water for a second. Man, that thing's pretty. Oh shoot, there's little like there's little fish living inside it. It's its own little biome. What the That wasn't just me, right? You guys heard that giggle too, right? It was right in my left ear cup. What the heck was that? Rising temperatures detected in mineral rich fissure below. Okay, it's gonna be really weird getting out of here. Another site found, but I cannot yet tell whether the others survived. Still, it holds valuable information. I hope you will find more. 
Probably. The network is indicating more of my people's technology, but the images I am receiving are fragmented, repeating. I am struggling to locate them precisely. Fragmented images? Why would that happen? I can only theorize that the locations are deep and shielded by a refractive material. Perhaps amongst large crystal formations. <gasps> Kinda crystal cr formation? That would be lovely. Huge chunk of diamond here. I'm not worried about diamond. I, there's a place right under my house that has a ton of diamond if I need it. Which I don't think I do right now. Yeah, if there's a place with crystal formation, please guide me to it, Mr. Voice. Hold on. Yeah, I don't want to stray too far from Voyage because we're only at 37% power. If anything, we should head back and drop off what resources we do have. Huge chunk of quartz. I need to figure out where I can find Kynite. And it has to be very deep down. Eh, no, wait. I don't need it right now. It has to be really deep down. Somewhere with a huge amount of heat and pressure. So... Below a volcanic vent area, maybe? We also need to do the shutoff thing for uh, our pilot friend. Well, not friend, but going to be friend. Because what's the point of exploring the ocean if you can't make friends? There we go. What's up? But ultimately, I have no definitive evidence as to the fate of my people. The network I hoped to rejoin may no longer exist. I cannot feel it. There could be a million reasons for that. Like, what if the network had a system update? They're on version 2001.4 and you're still on version 14.2. That would make me incompatible. How would I even begin to plan my upgrade? Okay, that's not what I meant. Bad example. You still know how to get home? Yes. So don't give up. Go there, see for yourself what happened. You are expressing optimism, but it is not supported by probability. Hope isn't based on statistics. It's born from a drive for something better. There's a poem Sam loved. Hope is human. Hope is... Uh, oh, oh, right. Hope is... Bah, 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 human. Defense system. This does not match Whoa. I can find in your PDA. It's a line from a 19th century Earth author. Emily something. Hope is the thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tune without the words and never stops at all. I promise we'll get answers one way or another, Alan. 
adding hope to your database. Hmm. <laughs> the bad timing to be interrupted by whatever that was. I, c I actually haven't got a name for that one. I just know it's big and it's scary. That's all I need to know. Careful. The defense system just on now, or do I have an off switch? I <laughs> I panicked for a second. I was like, uh, possible escapes. Let's see. Uh. Almost there. We're just gonna do some repairs and uh, also recharge everything that needs to be recharged. Then we'll probably head back out. Actually, uh, let's reposition a bit because. There we go. Because we're going to detach our modules so I can put this to charge. I think just having the two is more than enough for now. The two modules, I mean. The crafting one is... It's a nice thought, but I don't think I need it as much as I want it. That and the bunk. I don't think I'll need the bunk at all. Oh, right. We left stuff back in the thing. Uh, hold on. You could, in theory, build an entire base uh, just of sea truck modules. <laughs> It'd be stupid, but it can be done. Uh, I guess that's all we got from there. A lot of health kits. Ton of health kits. And you could use some repairs, my friend. You worked really hard. There you go. Though I do miss Zipper the Sea Moth. Voyage is definitely better. <laughs> oh cool, our pepper plant's ready. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna have to build a new locker for this because we have a ton of it.
and this is just the beginning. We should actually wait. Do we just need ion cube and a battery for this? Cured newt fish. Uh, what do we need for the ion? gold and silver and lithium? It would be worth it, though. Well, it might be worth it. I'm not sure. We might need to do some resource hunting if that's the case. Yeah, we don't have a lot of gold to work with. Even in our stores, we have some nickel, but not a lot of gold. Let's put the lithium in here, rubies, and... Still need to figure out what to do with the reactor rod. We can put the fiber mesh in here, not you. You're not going in there. You go over here. This will essentially be just a power options locker. Uh, but for now, let's put them in here because I actually don't know if it's going to fill it up. Take these two, leave this. Let's unload the rest of it. Let me look at my storage. Yeah, this is definitely going to fill up a locker. <laughs> Okay, any power options in here that we can just throw in there? Ooh, wait, wait, wait. An ion power cell wouldn't be a bad idea. What does it take for that? Silicone rubber, two ion... Ba oh, that's a lot. Alright, let's go grab some lithium then. We're doing this. Let's go. Ah, okay. Uh, power options. This one. Go in there. You think power drains bad now? Let's see what happens when you're looking for lithium. Actually, what do I need to upgrade you? Right. Okay, hold on. Cancel that. Computer chip and magnetite. We have magnetite now. We have... Uh, I don't want to do the camera drone, because why? Um, silver and gold for the scanner room speed upgrade. And scanner room range will be copper and magnetite. We can do this. What? What am I stuck on? Hello? There we go. Let's throw on some music while we're working. Music is back this way. I was gonna say, there's no way we don't have magnetite. We do have to build this too. Gold, silver, typical. Okay. Okay, we'll build this and then we have to head back to. Where was it? Uh, the Delta Station Communication Tower? And we need to, I think, repair that one. We also have to damage the one back at uh, our sister's base. <clears throat> at least our surface base. <clears throat> But for now, let's focus on upgrades for the scanner room, because we need some lithium. 
I broke I could probably remember this on my own, but I don't feel like it right now. A little bit of copper, a little silver, a little gold. Um what do we need for a computer chip? Table coral. Any chance we got? Yeah, we got extras. Another piece of gold and two more copper. Da da da. Let's put those in. We already have our HUD installed. Uh, let's do one more range upgrade. Yeah, let's do each of these. One copper, one magnetite, one silver, one gold. Because why not? We have the means, let's do it. Cruella de Vil, Cruella de Vil. Do, 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 do. I watched the uh, Cruella de Vil movie recently. Way better than I had anticipated. Not not saying it's like an amazing movie, but holy cow, way better than I thought it was going to be. Tons of fun. Let's get rid of these. Bop, boop, boop. And let's go find some lithium. Favorite song in Subnautica? I only know the names of the songs in the jukebox. Hold on. Let's see. Not this one. Well, then again. That drop was nice. I think First Sun Die Peacefully might be my, my favorite so song out of these ones. Deep Blue, as much as I like Miracle of Sound, it's kind of annoying when you have to listen to it on loop, and I listen to it on loop like for the first bit a while. I think diving too deep is uh is my favorite out of all of them. All right, let's go get that lithium. It'd be kind of funny if you could build a uh, a speaker onto your whoop, onto your sea truck modules, and then you could just listen along the way. Let's hope we don't come back to a base with absolutely no power. Alright, time to stock up on lithium and nothing but lithium. Waves keep on washing over me. Dive into the ocean.
We're only giving one little piece at a time. I hear something close. It wants to kill me. When has that not been the case with anything big here in this game? What's with all the lithium down there? What is that? Hello, sea monkey. I still don't know how you're supposed to teach them to grab items. That's something I, I will learn eventually, I just don't know how to do it. Yeah, what's all- what's this cluster of lithium down here? Is there seriously like a bunch of lithium all the way down here? Careful. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Maybe a bunch of lithium was exaggerating, but there's still quite a bit. A fair amount. Not much we got so far, nine pieces. in the wall. Can't do anything about that. I was gonna say we're good, but uh, apparently that's not the case, and I gotta get back to Titan. Oh, there you are. I was like, Titan, where the hell, where did I park you? Careful, 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 careful. No, oh, wait, we caught a ledge, we're good.
Back up, back up. Okay. Did I need table coral for anything? I don't think I did. I mean, if I do, it's not a big deal. I can just swim down and grab some, but... Careful. And park. Welcome aboard, Captain. Lots of lithium. Okay, we're splitting it, and I don't think it's going to fit in here anyways. It's fine, we're going to be... We're going to be using some of it. Anyways, sorry, just doing a little stretch break. Because I need it. Uh. Oh, that kind of hurt. <laughs> I don't know why. Scanner room. Shoot, it's like draining everything. Hold on. What else can you scan for? Uh, silver, table coral, titanium, lithium. You can scan for heat areas? Weird. It'd be wonderful if you could scan for kyanite. Oh, hold on. Might be important. Turns out was not important. Why do I get stuck there? Wait, we have peppers. Power cell, two power cells actually. We're making two of these. And what else do we need? Gold and silver. Two gold, two silver. One, two, one, two. I may be j jiving, I may be grooving. You guys can't see it, y'all can't prove it. Oh wait, we need to make two more of those. Iron cube, gold, silver, okay. Bup, bup. Not you, this one. Now we need silicone rubber and one other thing. Wiring kits. Two more silver. Four more silver. Never mind. One, two, three, four. We're running out of silver. Is one enough for this? Yeah, it should be enough. Do, 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 
do, do, do. Not on not on Voyage. Voyage has been doing all right with power conservation. Titan, however, could use an ion power cell or two. Cool. Two ionic power cells, which means that he should last a long time now. this up so I could just back up into it. Hold on. And position to pick up Titan. Let's build that disruptor if we can. The edibles in this game? Um, I'm not a fan of spicy stuff, so I wouldn't go for the pepper. Most of the fish... Let's see what we got on the menu. I would probably go for the boomerang fish. Because the peeper uh, eyeballs probably aren't as tasty. Uh, it's very gelatinous, very chewy, and it has that glassy center to it. It's not uh, the greatest thing to eat, for, at least for me. It's not the greatest thing for me to eat. Um, that, and it's kind of spongy, apparently. Boomerang, however, uh, it looks pretty meaty near the middle, and apparently the fins are pretty good. I don't know why anyone would ever eat a bladderfish. I personally would never. <laughs> they look so gross when it comes to food. You probably could mix it into something like a, a stew. I don't know. Right, we are here to build things. Hold on. <laughs> Come on, brain. So we're not losing it yet. Da, 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 da. Not the tether tool. Where to go? There we go. Gold, silver, table, coral. Use our diminishing resources. Waves keep on washing over me. Signed to the ocean. Titanium, lead, and copper. Two coppers and titanium, lead. Titanium, and I think we picked up a little extra lead. Yes, we did. Good job, past me. Diagnostic module for the Delta Station communication tower. Perfect. Onward to Delta Station. Not there. That one. 
Luckily, I got up early because that means I have an extra. I have an extra hour for this. Wouldn't the bladder fish deflate if you tried to cook it? Probably, and it would taste very spongy, like more spongy than they say the peeper tastes. It would probably be like, uh, what do you guys call it? Not veal. Veal is, veal is like young sheep. It's called. Tripe. It probably feel a lot like eating tripe, which, if you don't know, tripe is the stomach lining of the cow. Very chewy, very spongy, and the texture is a little weird. Not something you eat on the rig. It's uh, something you gotta get used to. Oh yeah, it's actually probably easier to explore here on foot. Man, with the thermal suit, the, up here is nothing. Well, it's something. Okay, we're, we're losing heat a bit. Not a crazy amount, but a bit. If in the future we ever run into alien civilization, I'm probably going to be one of the frontliners uh, cooking stuff up, trying to figure out what... What A, what's edible, and B, what tastes really good? Mineral detector fragment. But that probably would be put off by the importance of figuring out what we can find out medically about aliens. Hello, I bring diagnostic. Wait. I did bring di diagnostic tool. I thought I might have forgot it. Now back to the terminal. <laughs> Please work. Yep. Yes. Satellite is down. Perfect. I am impressed. That was most resourceful. All right, let's go talk to our potential friend. Hello. All right, Altera. You win this round. Come find me at my greenhouse. I'm about a kilometer east of your position up on an iceberg. I have a present for you. I'll come oh. by if I have time. <laughs> sure. Whatever. If you have time for me in your busy social calendar. Waves keep on washing over me. Dive into the ocean. But, but it's stuck in my head now. We're stuck with this. What about you, Tinny? Uh, what would you, what would you, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. I think we're good. Anywho. Um, Tinny, what, what would you probably be more likely to eat out of Subnautica? And, uh, expanding on that question, would you ever try to eat any of the Leviathan class entities? 
Because I definitely would. There's probably some good meat on them. Whoops. Okay, wait. Where are the coordinates of where we're heading? She gave us a new place to go to, right? Unless it was just... Yeah, it's just the last known location. Okay. Let's go. That didn't end well for him. You gotta knock the heck out. I can tell you one thing though, a, a sea dragon probably tastes terrible. It's pro it probably has like a sulfury flavor to the meat. Ooh, yeah, the crunchy bits would probably be pretty good. Alright, where are we dropping, boys? This looks good. Um, let's get a little closer to the ocean floor so that we can actually dock later. Warning, passing 100 meters. Oxygen I wish we could repair boost. from the inside of the vehicle. Benny was telling me it was follow the O2 plants. They'll they'll guide me to the base we're looking for. It's not damaging, but boy, is it annoying. Okay, as long as we're above, or just below Voyage, we should be near where we're looking at? That looks familiar. Okay, so it should be down here then. Yep. We're, we're on the right path. This looks familiar. I swear this is the third time we meet this lady. She better not jump scare us again. Waves keep on washing over me. Warning. 
warning. Okay, I guess we'll park here. Meters. Oh, efficiency greatly decreased. Can we park in here? Yeah, I figured we wouldn't be able to. Dang it. Okay, this isn't the right place then. Uh, she said she was on an iceberg, but I don't know if that would be near her base or if that would be like... Hmm. Okay, last known pilot location. Alien distress call origin. Sea truck main cabin. I think we could drop the drop pod for a bit. It's about a kilometer east of... Oh! I could have just gone a 1k east. Dang it. Alright, back to Delta Station. I wasted all y'all's time. I wasted all y'all's time. Luckily we had that extra 40 minutes to go with. Because now we're actually going to get something done. I wonder if she's already been training the sea monkeys to collect things for her. Hold on, we need water. But I mean, we also... Hold on. Let's also grab something IRL. If I ever get affiliate and I'm able to do bits, not bits, bits wouldn't be the right thing. If I'm able to do uh, points, hydrate, it's definitely going to be on that list because I always forget to drink. Voyage, we have another voyage to go on. So 600k east of the Delta Station area. repair my boy. There we go. The sea truck was definitely a great addition to the game. It's so helpful. And it's definitely getting getting an eye on power cell as soon as I'm able to build one. We need to stock up on more copper, gold, and silver. Not that we need to, it's just I really want to. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, from the Delta Station dock, we want to turn east, which is... 
that way. Let's go. And just to reaffirm. Kilometer, yeah, one kilometer east. One click. Let's go. Another one? Maybe. What the? Hello, beautiful. You are super cool. Oh wait, no, I've already, I've already, uh, interacted with these things. You can ride them. Maybe this is it? Is it time for another jump scare cutscene? happening over there it. <gasps> what are you oh hello precious <laughs> look at you I'm gonna scan you hold on pin carried oh hey little guy I feel like I've seen you underwater and I just haven't been paying attention to you but oh look at them flop you're just good boys, aren't you? You're just sea puppies. Oh. Well, you guys have fun. I gotta go find a garden. On the wrong iceberg. I did go east from the Delta station. Oh uh, well, we're only 609 meters. Well, counting the amount of walked on the island, it could it could just be past this. Because we need to, we need to go full K for that. And it doesn't look like there's anything on the adjacent iceberg, so we're going to go a little further and see if maybe it's a little ways up. I love that the whales breach in this game. That's so cool. It's such a nice little detail. Okay, uh, what the... F what was that noise? Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Dangerous something approaching? What was that sound? <laughs> you guys are wonderful. I like you. Just don't accidentally swallow me, please. Okay, a little further east, maybe. Uh, sorry, didn't mean to crash into you. I'm driving blind on this one.
So I'm thinking here ish. Hold on. Again, ish. I don't know if there's actually the spot. There is more plant life here, so if she was going to start a garden, this might be the place to do it. Do we have to bring Titan? I don't know if there's going to be any threats on the island. I hear music. Could be a good indicator. Okay, uh, oh shoot, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. Well, I might not be in the right place. I don't know. She sh she said it was just east of where I was, which was the Delta Station. So, where are you? This is the only I iceberg I've seen that can sustain life. One of these days I'm gonna do that and just dive into a mouth. I know it. It's gonna happen eventually. Ma'am, if you're on this island, please let me know. I need food and water. Alien tech? Cool. Well, shoot, I didn't find a grow garden, but I found a satellite. Alright, I'm convinced that there probably isn't a grow garden on here. So let's head back. Maybe continue east, I don't know. Get on the thing. Get on or get in the thing. One of the two. Hey, of it. There we go. Onward east still. We have to have gone over the 1k that she told us to go.
Because at this point, it's getting ridiculous. Like, how far did she go to make her grow garden? Jump out for a sec. Ah, snow. Good to know. Please give me a warning if I hit a dead zone. I'd rather not get killed out in the open ocean. Which this is looking a lot like. Warning. Entering ecological yep. dead zone. The prospect for survival is fast approaching zero. I hear it. We're, we're heading back. Okay, if we head back towards Delta Station, we're bound to come across some type of landmass that could resemble... Wait, we are heading towards Delta Station, right? Yep. Okay, we're bound to encounter some kind of landmass that resembles a grow garden. Hopefully. Because we went well over 1k in our exploration. Honestly, it might be better to just head back to base. Because I kind of had to end the stream soon. Yeah. Okay, for now we're going to head back to base, unfortunately. I really wanted to find her. I really wanted to uh, progress the story a bit, but... Uh, apparently she's not on any of the icebergs I was looking at. We're good. <sighs> I'm glad I invested in the perimeter defense system. Man, we're 23 meters up. That thing can seriously get us from here? Watch for vents, make sure we don't crash into anything. get some rest and we'll also put Titan in actually I don't I don't think we need to put Titan in you're fully charged right no like you don't need a charge but why not since we're signing off anyways Bloop. Thought we had more water than that. Yeah, that's a, that's okay. We're get, we're getting near the end of it, so if we're lagging out, that's fine. But uh, yeah, 
I had a lot of fun. We didn't get as much done as I had hoped we would, but it was a nice break. <sighs> All right. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, I got to get going, but I will hopefully see you guys in the next stream, which might be earlier than I'm thinking. Because uh, if I come back home and there's literally nothing else to do, I might jump back on for uh, some random game streams this afternoon. It'll be pretty late, though. Uh, other than that, I'm planning on doing another stream tomorrow of Hollow Knight. So, yeah, look forward to that. Actually, wait. No, uh, not tomorrow. <laughs> I lie. Um, it is Wednesday, so on Friday we're probably going to be playing Hollow Knight. And then tonight, maybe we'll do a random game stream. Probably Risk of Rain. Um, but for now, that's all I got. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next stream. Goodbye for now.